see what this is all about. Not completely ear destroying. That is already very good. Eh? I'm already impressed. I'm already impressed. Yeah, not instantly destroying you from the get go. That's good. Eh? Let's select. Confirm. A blue off. All right. Okay, yes, sixty. All right. Sure. Sure. See what I see. Huh? The DLCs aren't that pogies, I see, I see. How's it going, Corey Sudden? Got some more rest today. Got some more rest today. Now let's go with the original here. See how it's intended to be. So discounting the place out will bring us the answer we seek. All the further actions of the Earth fleet will be undertaken based on the results of what you can find, Major. Got it. Entering the atmosphere in 3 and 2. That's these two, alright. Population the colony did not die out, but the refugee that will occur after some kind of accident uh, can explain why we cannot sense any human life forms on the surface. In that case, I make contact with the senior staff colony president, uh, Agriman and Archivari, who so uh, must be evacuated. This is why we have cruiser station. Flint HQ approaching all the. Then it was successful. A sensor showed the base a few kilometers away. Uh, moving out. Next to the major, I give it a semper. Alright, so the aim on the movement, sure. And saying 180 there. A big pulga. Quarter sensors have detected an endemic fauna of a particularly frisky nature. I might need to defend myself. That's right, I uh, used the robust twin turbo laser cannons, and don't worry, according to our information, uh, there are no living creatures on the planet that can uh, damage the outer shell of your mech. Sounds kinda sus. Under 
fully mech with ears, yeah. Acceleration function with this shift. Seems like more dodge than the acceleration, really. Basic rhythm. Yeah, maybe they will show from different angle. Maybe it's like to to get like the air or something if you're like partially submerged underwater or something. Or maybe it's gonna be some like gun cannons or whatever too. An acid leak ahead. Uh, is this a word by passing it or filling it with rock debris? The acid can cause a serious damage to the back. It is worth by passing it. Uh, let's see. I'll leave the steelborn. Uh -huh. Then we can go back. Then with the sword and stuff too. We can jump. Alright, we can. Oh, I see. Go all the way there, I guess. A little bit too sensitive on the jumps and stuff, but I guess. The four years, yeah, that's what we're trying to figure out. What exactly is this all about? Yes. This is Doga. Sort of though. Well, at least some Sputniks there, yeah. I'm not sure, maybe it's just kind of like the reference over there. And maybe just kind of the, the Easter eggish stuff, not sure. Yeah, because I guess we'll probably just go. I will give you like some more inputs what to do. Maybe I just went there too early. It's kind of chunky boys there. I mean, they can jump though, so that's good. It is good at least. That's a lot of them. I know maybe we'll get something. Interact. And I guess a break here. Oh, okay. I'll see. This way then. I guess this also can explode, huh? That was weird up there, though. God, now all this stuff is dead. Come on. What was that? I did end them. Um, Mech is equipped with a, a pneumatic ram that can destroy some uh, lesser obstacles on your path. Uh, try using it now. Recommend using uh, the uh, pneumatic ram uh, with a caution in combat. This is a powerful attack, but it will leave you vulnerable for a while. Maybe that was the ram there. The ram kick. Super kick. Ah, I see her. Right. Ram range. Ah, the way he done this still. I seem to think they do indeed no damage to us there. In the mecha, so they didn't lie when they said that. Maybe the super jump on this? No. What kind of sauce there? Guess not. Some quicksand shit here. No, it is, huh? No, it seems that uh, the mech is stuck in quicksand, damn. Eh? I'll panic, use the ram jump, aim your ram uh, down uh, towards the ground um, and wait until the energies uh, speak. Uh, this will uh, push the mech out of the trap. Also overcome high ledges and obstacles in the same way.
The rub down, alright, sure. Ram range ultimate. Boop. I guess also all going down there. You just jump over this. No, probably way better. Oof. Yeah, that's the super jumper there. Don't need a full charge on this, I guess, all right. The super tank builds. Uh, I actually can find uh, some tank builds for everything, really. So there is something here. I loaded the key, yeah. I think I need to later, probably, right? Ah. Save. swamp and there is a no jet fuel to spare I need to find another way I have to get out of your vehicle for example to enter a particular narrow passages oh, so some all right rock on the ground water we release them uh, already checked I guess and the dodge too the movement's pretty nice at least yeah that I already tried Jump kick. Okay. Sliding kick there too. Can you just? Don't you know this was the same way? I think you can. Yeah, I already think it's a kick watch, is it? Yeah, I think it's a sword slash or something. I don't think it's a super kick, eh? Really try to jump. I didn't really try to jump outside much. Rocket jump. Well, I mean, I thought it was the the long jump there. And some dang leeches there. It would be kind of cool if it's a bit darker here. Like you already have kind of like the the flashlight. Especially with all this like stuff jumping at you from the darkness. I think that would be kind of nice. Maybe there will be some darker stuff later. Yeah, we will see. They are dodge still. Mm, 
No. Toad. Oh. Okay, you don't see the projectile stopping there. That's pretty cool. The physics. The liquid physics. Come here. Can't stop this. This shit is still moving though. Not for long. HP here. Ah, it's a speedy boy. No open lights. I will see if there will be something. It is like some bright stuff. That could make the lightning a little more exciting. Maybe for now, it's just kind of like the tutorial stuff. If the stuff would be jumping out of the, the darkness, that'll be way more effective. Eh? Maybe jump there, boys. That's the oxygen, I guess, right? Yeah. So we do have oxygen limited there. I don't think we need to be here. Unlucky. Get the fuel back. Soundtrack or something is playing here somewhere. So there's something playing there somewhere. Maybe we'll find it up here though. Oh, yeah, I guess. Is that? Feels so good all of a sudden, huh? The magic spring. Eh? Oxygen wasn't feeling too good though. Covered the leeches? I think it's fine. I think it's fine. Well, maybe a bit too much. Uh... Was good in the beginning, that's for sure. When the first one jumped at you, that was nice. Didn't expect that. Mm, oh, this thing we can explode, I guess. Mm. That's a penis. Charge one too to break stuff. All right, that's faster. You have detected a meteor shower in the sector. Take cover in the cave or use weapons for defense. Otherwise, the mech may be damaged. Wonka is. Stuff falling, let's see. Break them. Not gonna get me here, I guess. Yeah, 
place from that angle always, I think. I charge only like this. Come on. Oh, come on, dude. Uh, what do they call this? It was, uh... Damn, I stole the battery. They smart. Should you have found a corpse of a call this? Uh, seems to be a research engineer. We'll try to get data from his PDA. Uh, Hans Liefschitz, I'm an engineer. Uh, for a dose, you may find this note on my wounded body. I will say one thing, run! Save your damn lives, uh, poor bastards. A few days ago, along with uh, my young and sassy companion, the son, Chad, Chad McMahon, sent out a geological survey on uh, this uh, sad little planet. The mission began as usual uh, with uh, a test of equipment and robotic suits. Very soon, we were attacked by the local fauna. Barely fought a back using standard colonial uh, Medusa 88 pattern uh, plasma guns, and I was uh, slightly hurt by the sharp fangs of these vicious creatures. Chad left me in the camp in front of uh, the entrance to the cave uh, where we intended to wait for help, and he went to check if everything was clean there. Tell by my beloved wife Sarah and about our wonderful children that uh, Tyrone Yusuf and Anastasia. Lord, how I would uh, like to be with them now, and hug them, at least for the last time. And my gloomy thoughts were interrupted by a wild uh, cry. It was Chud, but there was something else mixed with his screams and the roar of creepy monsters. A whole flock of these uh, toothy scums ran out of the cave, uh, which we so naively believed to be our salvation. Two of them were holding a bloody uh, pieces of Chud in their teeth, and oh god, they ate it. Realized that I was next in the menu, I will not give myself up to you, simply space scum. Furthermore, I'll detonate this grenade. And take as many of these man eating lizards with me to hell. The glory to the earth. The son. Of course, it seems that the local fauna turned out to be more dangerous than we expected. Eh? Seems so. However, this makes your assignment even more important, uh, Major. We need to get to uh, the bottom of what happened on this planet at all costs. Yeah, I'm using crawler vehicle to get to the entrance of the base faster. However, for this, I will have to scout the cave and find the battery that lizard stole. That's right, Major, but be careful not to repeat the fate of those poor sods. Alright, so go for the battery there. So ammunition we still don't really need. Teleport it back in, repair. Yep. Can we take it with me? I mean it seems maybe. No, probably not, right? No. Fine. Alright, that we need to explode. Eh? It goes a bit darker actually. A little bit. Not much, but kinda. At least they use some environmental lights and stuff too. I need this for something. Oh, you still back. Thought I got you there. Not sure if we will need them. Follow the blood there. Can 
new weapon. Plasmer. Alright, let's go. New PD. Where's the chod? Okay, because of this, they see, uh, though not for the same reason, uh, Dr. Cozy uh, said, Dan, why did I think you'd like a gift like a egg from one of those pesky green lizards? Whoever well, it would obviously be useful for your experiments or whatever else you're doing with that uh, boar egg Gozi. Otherwise, it would turn out that I climbed into the lair of these foul monsters in vain. Dr. Lifshitz received terrible injuries from these creatures. Most likely, it's already crawled to the base, and soon a rescue team will be sent for me. What a pity that the green freaks approaching me will not agree to wait for their arrival. Go here and get it. Take it. Ah, oh, recording cuts off abruptly. Then the child himself. And then she make its time. A welcome to the club. A welcome to the club. And live in that booger life. What the hell was that? That's a big boy there. Fuck with this. Screen. Nice. How is that possible? Lock it. Well, I guess a big problem. Just the first time that happened, but I guess. There, yeah, whatever. I guess. That's another way gonna be there. Thank you, one second. Okay, right, and here is the delivery. Good, then. Good, then. It's already going up, so I guess it's pretty much ready there. Alright, lost a bunch of HP. Did leave some over there. Uh, spiky boys were doing a bunch. No, oh, there it is, alright. Did they respawn the enemies there too? Seems like it. I'm not super worried then, I guess. But probably will find anyway. I will find some. Yeah, also losing oxygen that way. Probably not worth it. Alright, one sec, gonna go open.
Alright, han bor som på hemma. Och i vår del. Så, let's see. Alright. Playing bingo there with people. Then the sun. Gonna find some more advanced one, I would say. People playing something more interesting. As long as they don't play some some MOBA game, that's good enough already. That's good enough then. There it is. All right, let's see. And that in the same device. There it is. Whoop. <coughs> there it is. <laughs> the fuck about is this shit? <coughs> this. Print the wood. Come on, focus. Well, I mean, you can kind of read already. <laughs> Printed with soy ink, brother. Feels good. <laughs> Even the ink is soy already. Insane. All right. So you're gonna I'm gonna set this one up on next week. But yeah, let's open it at least, I guess. Actually, unironically doable to find the really good price because Razer has the official store here. So actual good uh, price and device. This one still costs cheaper than the Legato stuff. And by the looks of it, actually kind of more useful to be honest, more functional. Doesn't have the panels you can replace though with some skins, sadly. Probably only one, yeah, it's like powered by a loop deck. This is literally the same loop deck thingy, but it costs like 100 bucks cheaper than the, than the, loop, the loop deck here. Also from official store of loop deck. So I'm not sure why, I guess Razer didn't catch up with the price changes or something, I have no idea. But I have nothing against that. I surely have nothing against that. Oh yeah, there it is. So you're gonna have all the all the buttons and all the knobs here, so you can also control the the volume and stuff. Which they actually added a new stream deck, Elgato. But on that one, they cut them out of buttons though for some reason. So they added like one knob, I think, maybe a couple. And yeah, this one has more of that stuff, and all the buttons are intact. I shouldn't have to sort of stand for it. Oh yeah, there it is, nice. I think original actually doesn't have it or something. Well, stand. It's a pretty loud award for what it is. And it's like literally just this thing. And you just plug it in here. Yeah, there it is. It just extends this way. <clears throat> no, ba basic one is uh, yeah, but it's small. Thing is, this is all touch one. So technically, from what I seen, at least you can just like make like this like like button scenes. You press the button, and it's gonna switch to the scenes, right? Then you press another button, so you can like get as many as you want really buttons here. There's like a small version of this one also, but this one, that one is not being sold here. It has like, I think like 10 sensor buttons and the two knobs. And normally it should cost like 100 something bucks. I think like around 100 basically. So it's a pretty good offer compared to like the small... Can you mop custom icons? Yeah, yeah, yeah. You can mop everything. Uh, you can switch different sets of buttons. It should automatically detect too. Like you can put the GIMP for example, like, you know... 
uh it has i think um premiere or something also so basically you can just like use it in in different apps with different like sets of buttons if you want so we'll see maybe i'll mess with that stuff i didn't find anything for unity <laughs> not sure what you would use for unity really but you know it might be kind of useful for other things too Cable. Oh yeah, I think the cable here is also kind of different. Mm, pretty nice with the with the cloth and stuff. Oh yeah, and this one has like the side the side connector. We can you kind of like plug it in here so the cable goes to the side. Pretty good. Because I think original doesn't have that stuff. It has just like the regular USB and no stand thingy, so everyone kinda like 3D prints this shit. <clears throat> have you still been a casual user? Uh, well, I, I basically got this one for like around 300, I think, or something. Around that, yeah, I think. Normally it's cheaper. It's just, you know, if I would be getting it here from Amazon, for example, it still would be around the same amount. So I decided to get this one because everything is getting too expensive now. Like Elgato is more expensive than this, uh, Loop Deck is more expensive. And I just by accident realized that there is this thing, and this thing is literally a Loop Deck, just kind of reskinned by Razer. It's supposed to be more expensive than a regular Loop Deck, but it's kind of the other way around, it's cheaper here. <laughs> well, I mean, you can you can find uh, the basic small version from Amazon or something. I think that one should be like kind of 100 or something bucks. Like normally they're 200, I think, from Amazon, 200, a little over 200, I think. But considering, you know, conversion rates, considering the fee you need to pay to order from there, delivery price and stuff, it would be kind of like pretty much the same shit almost. So I was like, well, might as well just order it here then. Like I'm not saving too much if I get it from Amazon. And yeah, as I said, like save, just saving currency here right now is not the best idea because it just kind of becomes pointless all right so i'll need to clean some area for it and yeah i'm gonna be also picking up the stand for my new for my cam from the kitchen i'm gonna be switching from kitchen to here and remove the webcam use that usb here probably so we'll see this is gonna be nice so you can you know like mute or switch something without like all tabbing and everything Six button one four hundred euro, yeah, yeah, yeah. Also with some knobs and stuff, right? The same one, like the loop deck, right? Or you mean uh, Elgato? Elgato has six bu six button one, yeah. Check the loop deck. Uh, that's how it's written. Like Razer doesn't have the smaller one version, but yeah, this one. L O U P E D E C. Check that one. That that one has uh, live S version, I think. It's also a small, kind of more budget one, but it's better. Like it has more buttons, I think, than six. They all touch buttons, so you can remap them. And it also has a couple of knobs, so you can adjust volume with that stuff. Make full, yeah, 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 you can, you can. On this one too. So I would say pretty good, eh? We'll see it in action next week. Because tomorrow I'm probably not going to have time to adjust it. And I still need to pick stuff for the camera so I can free the USB. I guess I could try with one I have already, but whatever, we'll see. But we'll figure it right. But yeah, I only got like the Razer version because Razer version actually is just cheaper than original here. <laughs> Other than that, the original is probably even better because you don't need to install anything. L-O-U-P-E deck. A loopy. Lupe. A lupe deck. Check that one, maybe. But yeah, I guess for six buttons one, you also can make folders or something, but just there's no knobs, so you can't adjust that. Can't adjust that. Do right, sorry. Sorry, got that. Yeah, I'm just kind of like basically having, you know, currency, especially our currency on hands. It's not really optimal. So yeah, I'm just like, what I don't super need eh, to save eh? uh, that I either be using something useful or just gonna be 
converting everything in fucking dollars or something. And probably the cash ones even. Because you never know here. Oh man, it's respawned everything. It might be not very fast. Not very good, eh? Oh, there we go. Convenient. Thank you. Now, Ilgata has uh, the newer one. That one also has some knobs and everything. That one also looks kind of nice. But yeah, this one, this one looks good. I like it. And it's actually kind of like... Is like the side kind of metal? No, I don't think so. But yeah, like more solid, yeah? I think like the frontal panel is like metal or something. Or like really good plastic. Like it's even like kind of cold. You know, it's not really cold outside. The knobs are nice. Knobs are kind of like with the with the click, you know, not like the smooth turning, but like with the clicks. I hope they're gonna last long enough. But not not like I'm gonna. Well, actually, I'm gonna be using them a bunch though. I think it would be nice to adjust like the volume on stuff so you don't get uh, your ears destroyed uh, when we're launching stuff. And for my mo uh, for microphone too, so I'll be able to adjust like when I'm in the kitchen, for example, maybe getting it a bit a bit higher and stuff. The volume control would be nice. Yeah. And you can like uh, set many different things to control. There's also CT version. CT version is like super dang. That one for like the the, the video editors. There's like the huge, you know, like this like huge knob to like to to, to tune uh, like the timeline on the video like smoothly. But that shit here is like like it it, it normally costs like four hundred bucks I think or something. Here is like a thousand. <clears throat> Yeah, so I was like kind of like decided to go for this one because like buying something kind of like niche specific for a reasonable amount of money is really rare here. That's why I decided to go to buy this one. I was already considering like getting through Amazon. Like my friend said he could try to to order it for himself in Uzbekistan and then send me through like our local um like shipment company holy shit what fuck was that like all the like ex soviet countries have like all this logistics set pretty good eh? from the old times eh? a lot of people from here sending all, all the work immigrants sending money home from here so all that stuff is set pretty good, eh? Pretty easy to send here. But pretty cheap, too. Alright, stuff started actually to kind of hurt sometimes, though. Alright, let me just... What if you... Arrest now, will it just respawn everyone? I would assume so. The smaller one, the S one. That's yeah, kind of expensive for it, I would say. Especially if you can get like the the Ilgata six button for a hundred bucks, then I think that's that's kind of better. But that one doesn't have the volume adjustment yet, so you can check. Uh, I think it's just like it got the stream deck like Mark II or something or version two, the one with the knobs also. Maybe that one reasonably priced. It should be below two hundred, I think. And here is expensive as fuck too. It should have like eight or like ten buttons or something and two knobs, I think. Deck plus. All right, all right. 
No, we said we actually have like the the Razer official store and stuff. That's why it was that cheap actually. Like seems like they they sell with somewhat reasonable prices. Because like loop deck costs an insane amount, like five hundred bucks or something almost. Like four hundred for sure. Like Elgato would be cheaper then. But then I found this razor thingy, like by accident, I didn't even know. It looks like not a lot of people know because like when I started reading reviews about this uh, razor thingy, people were like, oh this is like literally like the loop deck ripoff. Like Razer stole the idea, and it's literally just said on the box this like collaboration between them. Because it is exactly the same. Yes, he's okay, see. Well, I mean, we rarely kind of do it, but I guess, you know, for Razer, we have enough gamers with enough money, probably, to buy their overpriced stuff. And then most of the time. What the hell? Okay, I think I need to kind of get out of here again. I don't want to get caught by that stuff, seems like. And I can dodge out of it. Oh, didn't get me? Come on. Just quite OP here, I would say. That's also like the, something gone there now. That has ammo. And I guess for now I'm not running out of ammo. Run. Close you on though. With the season zero battle pass. Wait, what is that? Before the game is even out. Oh yeah, change the weapon now. So I guess I did that. I lose the ammo exactly when it's time. How about we don't die here now? That would be very nice. Good. See, like, already start, like, farming it right now before the game is even out. What do you, what, what do you need to do with that? Post likes on his tweets or something? Or in the videos? How do you do that? Okay. Go back up. I have unfinished business there. Maybe I should die. Probably shouldn't explode it that fast, even. Progressy, I don't remember anything about it for a while already. Haven't heard anything except all the drama about it basically since the very the very announcement I think. The drama is the only thing I heard. Okay, dash in the air we already seen. Already did even.
Oh, they showed three, three matches last night. Uh, Luke scuffed. Not that bad, eh? Is that bad, eh? Can I teleport my mech here? It seems kind of like wide enough. Come on. <laughs> Come on. This thing's floating your ass. Fine. The way play it when you have all those AAA uh, shooters. Oh, yeah, should be some sort of like unique proposition there. What's special about it? I'll get the Giga Speed, huh? Eh? Okay, it doesn't matter if you get the Giga Speed, eh? Playing it over. Well, that's a bit different. This is the single player game. Single player game, you know, you finish one, you can finish another one. You can play all of them. With multiplayer, it's a little bit different, though. Multiplayer is a bit different. Because those you can play a lot. So, yeah. Brother, I miss that the jump and it's over. Like, come on. Come on. Everyone kind of expects to make their the next the biggest thing, you know, always. Uh. If I get stuck on some mobs here, that will be very unfortunate. Just 
just run. Don't fuck around with stuff. Barely made it. I can't creature you with that. Power is stored. I need to load the mech onto the lift. Pichiri, uh, the BR of the era, but with extraction. I mean, that's how it is already. It's just right now, you know, uh, those people who jumped on the hype train, they're just kind of like starting to arrive. Huh? Like all those projects, they're just starting to be to be made now. Starting to release and everything. And the air dash too, alright, sure. That's a big air dash there. A bit too much. that. It's here dashing too much, dude. Don't jump too far. Can you kill him over there? Doesn't seem like it. Come on. Man, air dashing here is annoying <laughs> with this one. It's better as a Hume. Other games from the past era, I mean, sorta. The old Flash games did, huh? Yeah, it's not a bad thing. But that era wasn't bad, huh? I think exactly is the inspiration. Some of the flash ones and everything. Thank you guys, thank you. Define target detected, open fire. Call the AI. Fucking AI, man. Thank you guys, thank you. Gonna be our undoing. Gotta go ham, eh? TCU. Are we big now? Is 
Some stuff you can like break with the guns. Some stuff I guess you need to delay though. Okay, this big one. And we also can break. Get him. Come on. Okay, too, too slow. And then you break this like this, and the rest will just shoot. Still, ah, you heal in there, okay. I'll see. No, shoot. Just wanted to like stop the cooldown a bit. Fuck you. No healing. I'm gonna be shooting now. That doesn't sound good. That's gonna be the case. I uh, see. Right. The jump is gonna PP again. Actually, I would say the. No. How can you? I'm not sure actually if you can. No, we're eating. No, the, the human platforming actually is. Uh, Pretty smooth, eh? The back is a little bit more scuffed. But I guess, you know, maybe that was the goal. To get the feeling of the scuffed mech. I can just drink the poison too. Nice. That's simple. Make it kind of delayed and everything there. Overheating. How was that? Oh, okay, there's some sort of like charge, yeah? Well, we counted that. Get over the heating. That's kind of not the best idea to get over in this situation. Ah, we can do melee there. Okay, okay. To interrupt. gets into charge or something like that, I guess. Okay, we can counter that. The room door is 400 bucks. Yeah, that sounds that sounds about right. Now it's moving in. It was cheaper, but yeah, that also was seven years ago. No, more even. Nine years ago. But they are quiet. They are quiet. Start the education protocol. They were quite expensive, especially with uh, installing them. You know, have kind of like the easy little ones, no? Nothing, you know, fancy out of like the whole, the whole wood or something. Hux is denied, and it looks like I'll have to ram the gate. No, you have the ram, though. 
Let's do this too. You managed to get into the base, uh, but the plus doors are sealed and, and there is no way to open them. The stood uh, used the biological purifier or shaft to penetrate the interior. That's uh, so how I need to get in there. Let's see. The blast doors. Uh, Yeah, I think 200 was when I was getting it. Well, that I think was the case. Okay, what is this? It's like a piece of something there. Oh, there's like the conveyor belt there. to get there. Let's see so okay, see. Okay, that's not good. HP. the whole bunch of this stuff. Alright, explore the base. The key for that probably. I like the hub. Please bypass and destroy this blockage. Yeah. That stuff, all right. I want to chic. It's a seat here, but we need to find the, the chic point. I'm gonna try to go this way then. Fine. No, oh, well, literally there. <laughs> Shit, okay, again. I killed you already there. Seemed like he was like sitting there. I 
I guess not. Kind of stuck here. There we go. That's a big boy there. The, the Kakuzi doctor, right? With a study, local fauna was able to isolate a mutagen that causes an increase in the size of living creatures. This discovery can be very useful, especially for me. High time for me to get the recognition I deserve and move from this nasty planet to the spacious office of the Central Sciences Academy of Earth, but without proving the properties of the mutagen, I can hardly hope for the fulfillment of my hopes. So I'm the pure mutagen free creature, and I don't even know where to get one. Assistant Wanda's pet is quite suitable for the, this purpose. And despite its obvious death, it will serve the benefit of science. There's the sun. Was that the pit? I guess. That was the pit, probably. And that's some fucking crab. Or a spider, or something. You know, both. Jeremy, and son. Soon though, again. Gone now. Uh, Should gun works. See secret I see. He's suffering. The Jeremy is gone. It looks like I found uh, one of the survivors, uh, so to speak. Is a Spielehund belonging to the security service? Doboy Himbo Saba obliged me to take a blood debt by Davis Rex, then the Weeb Dog. <laughs> Before this is through, I shall see you again. That's the intelligent weeb dog. Eh? A key card, access the LB, and I can go through the checkpoint. Oh, Major, couldn't hear your message. Um, not important, so never mind. Eh? Have to throw the trash out.
All the crab meat. I wasted the Ah, wait, couldn't they just jump out of there? And we go back. Oh, we can, yeah. Crab meat. HTB channel, though. How are we doing? Alright, uh, I reload my weapons. Please. I never learn. Who's back here, right? Yeah, okay. Let's see where it is. Keep here, go. That's the back of water design. I'm just open the air now. Yeah, this one we don't have yet. Not enough clearance. And now we can save now. See how we can open this to now. It's a level of energy. Can we see that energy there? Hmm, alright. Didn't get a full idea with those, so that's fine. Uh, doing good. Nice, Misha. Nice. Doing good too. Trying uh, the new stuff, the new games. Which, speaking of, it might be time to get another one going too. We do a uh, one more today. A uh, one more. This was nice. This was nice. Yeah, the mech, the mech stuff might be a bit janky and some shit, but actually, like running as a, is uh, the mech pilot is quite good there. Eh? Uh, very nice, very nice movement stuff. Feels good. Feels pretty good. Eh? And the jammers are nice too. So not a bad. Eh? Not bad. Eh? Yeah, I guess this lights. It's not ears. Seems like these are lights there. Not the furry mech. Not the furry mech. Ooh right. Ooh right. Now we're gonna do another one. Another one. Now we do another one. Um, Alright, one second. The Pronti, yeah. Been some time, been a while. Alright, one second. Just gonna go to the bathroom then. Ian Visvicerino. Uh, one second then, let's roll the pre-roll removal too. Ian, I'll be back to play the next one. One sec, right back. <laughs> 